Hello, boys and girls of the YouTube Hype community. Thank you for tuning to my channel. I'll be your host, Happy Smoking 100. And I have something cool today. I have a Yabo. Yabo sounds so bad. It's like yet another box opening. It sounds like you're you're being trouble with this box that you have to open. It's like yet another box to open that I have to open. Oh, I love Yabos. They're my favorite video. They're better than VRs. They're better than Gauze. They're better than Rambles. Gauze is my favorite because you need to live vicariously through the person opening it and seeing what they're getting, and it's just exciting. So here she is from Smoking Pipes. Now, I said I wasn't going to do this, but I am a hypocrite. Yes, I am now selling pipe tobacco. However, I'm not going buck wild like I used to. I would spend like 200 bucks on a seller just to sell the tobacco. I'm probably going to order like maybe a couple tins. Like say I order 10 tins and maybe one or two will be for the seller and the rest will be to smoke. So let's dive into this baby. Head first baby. No cannonballs. With my trusty cookie knife. Or steak knife. It's dull as fuck. But it gets the job done. It comes nicely packaged. What is this? Got any pipes laying around? Turn them into cash or store credit. Basically, send them your pipes or give you shit from the sell them for a lot. That sums that up. I got some awesome stuff. Every pipe smoker needs these. I was out. I had like one brisk, like half, like no, not even like a quarter of a bristle package left, maybe like a, a fifth of a smooth one left. So now I have lots of pipe because this is probably going to last me like a week or two, like a week and a half because I take good care of my pipes because they're fucking expensive. All right, so let's start off. This is something I, I, I had this in my old cellar. Never got around to trying to end up selling it. Six pence by GLPs. Mm. This one I was really interested in trying. Slawny Virginia Flake. This sounds very tasty because I love me some Virginias. Oriental Silk. I don't remember what this was. Like, the way I do my my um, tobacco orders that go into uh, tobacco reviews. I search by like blend by like Burley, Virginia, Balkan, English, Aromatic, and then I filter them through comments and stars. And I just pick up the top ones and read the comments, see if I like it, and I just buy it that way. Like it's always fresh up to try. This I'm selling. This is opening night. This is a very good straight Virginia. So got one of those. This is something everyone's been talking about. Haunted book sh Bookshop. Never had it. This is not one I haven't had. I've, the reason I've been getting a lot of GLPs, they're all really good reviews. Like, GLPs is the man. Like, he, he has good shit. I'm getting it some um, Cumberland. This is another 10 I'm selling. HH Old Dark Fired. This one, Key Largo. I heard this goes very well in a mirror, so I can give that a try. Another tin of HH Old Dark Fired for the seller. Jackknife Plug, another classic. Another tin of Open Night, which I'm going to sell her.
Carnelian Diaz Super Balkan. That sounds tasty. Billy, but this is a very good scarf, and both, um, where is it? Both Key Largo and Billy Bud both have cigar leaf in them, so I'm going to be interested to try those out. I have another tin of GLP's Fillmore. I think I ordered like all of GLP's tobacco. Like I bought pretty much just bought GLP's out. Like it's crazy. These two I'm going to sell her. Orlick Golden Sliced. And bam, or the golden sliced. That's all the tins I'm gonna sell. I'm selling six tins, so this got good reviews. Hearth and Home Magnum Opus. This sounds good. I'm running out of room for all this tobacco. It's going crazy. I have some fourth generation, some Balkan Zassini, the angle slices. I've heard good things about this. Supposedly, this is a very good English. I think they sell it in bulk as well, but I just got the tin because I felt like it. And this is wrapped. It's a Christmas present, guys. It's like three months past Christmas, but it's a Christmas present. Let's see what it is. What could it be? What could it be? Who knows? HH Latkia Flake? HH Pure Virginia. That's right. I love me some HH blends. I am running out of room to put all these tins. And last but not least. Yes, guess what this is. Can you guess what this is? It's Peter Stokeby. What is it? It is Peter Stokeby Luxury Bullseye Flake. So that's it for my Yabo. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, hope you got to live vicariously through me as I enjoyed opening all these blends and they were all new to you. So it was very exciting. And on that note, I bid you farewell, YouTube.